Hi everyone, I am Apostle Michelle Peterson and I am so happy to have my voice back that I am recording a lot of videos today and I wanted to do a prayer and I want to start doing these prayers uh, but today what I wanted to do a prayer um, about is those who are struggling with uh, curses on your finances finances um, you're just struggling when it comes to your finances no matter what you do you are struggling something is wrong there's some type of block some type of hindrance something um, on your finances that is um, causing you not to be able to get past a certain level and you're a born-again believer you pay your tithes you give you know you you uh, sow you sow seeds and you're just not seeing um, any type of blessing returning you know whenever you do get financially blessed something happens where all that money that you just got blessed with it has to go to fixing something or buying something it's like everything starts breaking down and you have to you know spend all of this money that you just got but I, I'll tell you how you can tell if it's a curse if it's something that's constantly going on it's not something that you've only been struggling with for a couple of years this is your life this is every time you're hitting that wall you know every single time you can't remember a time where you didn't hit that wall that's that could be a curse okay and if you are a Christian and financially you're being a good steward over the, your finances and you're blessing other people you know and you're just not seeing anything come back and, and remain um, this could definitely be a curse and so what I want to do I want to pray because one of the types of curses that the Lord revealed to me could be a curse that's on our minds and if a curse is on our minds there's so many different ones and I'm gonna do different prayers um, that's on different areas uh, different curses on the mind different curses on the the heart and different curses uh, different areas I'm gonna do prayers for those and so you can go through and check out the different prayers uh, for your situation today we're going to talk about finances okay so what I want you to do I want you to get get in a place where you can just totally relax and totally focus on God I don't want you focusing on your finances um, anything that you have coming up any kind of bills um, none of that stuff because we need to shift your mindset to the Lord because he's going to be the one that's going to be there he's going to remove this off of you so you need to focus on him at this time okay so if you need to pause this video you can pause it before I start praying okay so if you are in that place where you're totally focused on the Lord I'll go ahead and start praying okay so the first thing I want to do I want to speak into you I want to speak love into you okay in the name of Jesus Christ, I speak love into your mind. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak love. I speak love. I speak love. I speak love into your mind. In the name of Jesus Christ, into every part of your mind. In the name of Jesus Christ, every compartment of your mind, I speak love. I speak love in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak love into your heart. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak love. I speak love. I speak love. I speak love. I command everything to be removed from your heart. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak peace. I speak peace into your heart. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak peace. In the name of Jesus Christ I command all demonic emotions to be removed from your heart in the name of Jesus Christ father I ask that you remove uh, the curse of poverty father from your people's mind father every person that is watching this father father I ask that you remove the curse of poverty from their minds every curse of poverty father I ask that it be removed from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ father I ask that you remove the curse of lack from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ father I ask that you remove the curse of fear from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of anger from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I ask that you remove the curse of jealousy from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I ask that you remove all the curses, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of rejection from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of rejection from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I ask that you remove all curses of rejection from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove all curses of lust from their minds in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I ask that you remove the curse of lust from each person's mind in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord. I ask that the curse of lust be completely removed from their mind. 
Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of anger and rage from their mind in the name of Jesus Christ, Father. I ask that you remove the curse of anger from each person's mind in the name of Jesus Christ, Father. I ask that you remove the curse of rage from each person's mind, Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness from their minds. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness from their minds. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, I ask that you remove the curse of panic from each person's mind. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of panic from their minds, Father. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness from their minds. Heavenly Father, Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness and torment from their minds. Heavenly Father, each person that is being tormented in their mind, Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove that curse of torment from their minds, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness from their hearts in the name of Jesus Christ. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of rage from their hearts in the name of Jesus Christ, Father. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unbelief from their minds, Father. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unbelief from each person's mind, Father. In the name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of fear from their hearts. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of fear from their hearts. In the name of Jesus Christ, Lord. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of pain from their hearts. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of pain from each person's heart. Heavenly Father, I ask that they be set free from pain in the name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of panic from their hearts. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of panic from their hearts in the name of Jesus, Father. I ask that you remove the curse of anxiety from their hearts, Father. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, I ask that you remove all anxiety from their hearts, Father. In the name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of torment from their hearts. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of torment from their hearts in the name of Jesus, Father. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of anger from their hearts. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, I ask that you remove the curse of anger and rage from their hearts. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, I ask that you remove the curse of rage from their hearts. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father. Heavenly Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness from their hearts. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father. Father, I ask that you remove all unforgiveness, the curses of unforgiveness from your people's heart. In Jesus' name, Father, I ask that you remove the curse of unforgiveness from the people's heart. Father, in Jesus' name, Father, I ask that you remove the curse of anger from their hearts in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I ask that you remove the curse of fear from their hearts in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I ask that you remove the curse of anxiety from their hearts in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I ask that you remove the curse of rage from their hearts in the name of Jesus. And Father, I ask that you remove the curse of pain from their hearts. In the name of Jesus. People who are struggling with unforgiveness in their hearts are being set free right now. People that are struggling with uh, anger in their hearts are being set free right now. In the name of Jesus. People with envy and strife are being free right now. In the name of Jesus. People with sickness in their bodies are being set free right now. In the name of Jesus. People with cancer are being set free right now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, someone with brain cancer is being set free right now. In the name of Jesus, someone with pancreatic cancer is being set free. In the name of Jesus, someone with ovarian cancer is being set free right now. In the name of Jesus. Someone that's being attacked by witchcraft is being set free. In the name of Jesus. Someone in bondage is being set free in the name of Jesus. Someone with unforgiveness in their minds is being removed from your minds right now in the name of Jesus. Your life is being changed right now in the name of Jesus. Your heart is being changed right now in the name of Jesus. Your life is being changed right now in the name of Jesus. God is flowing. He's flowing through you right now in the name of Jesus. Receive Him. Receive the Lord. Open up your hearts. Just relax. Tell the Lord you receive Him. In Jesus' name. I speak power. 
I speak power in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak power. I speak power. I speak power. I speak power in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak power. I speak power in the name of Jesus Christ that you are consumed with power in the name of Jesus Christ that you are consumed with power in the name of Jesus Christ that power flows through you in the name of Jesus Christ that you minister to people in power in the name of Jesus Christ. I release the power of God in the name of Jesus Christ. I release the power of God into your lives in the name of Jesus Christ. Everywhere you flow, everywhere you minister, when you speak, power will come through your words in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Receive it. It's yours. Alright, you guys. Uh, post comments, share in your comments, share uh, what you experienced. If you uh, experienced the healing, um, being set free, uh, God's presence, whatever you experience, share everything down below in the comments. Uh, like I said, if you have any specific things that you are struggling with, I'm going to be doing different prayers on different things um, that different people are struggling with. And so you can leave those things also. So I hope you guys are having a blessed 2018. And I will see you in the next video. God bless.